Yes, hello everyone and welcome back to a Clara Clary's YouTube channel. Actually, in today's video, I'm taking you through uh, Uganda Wildlife Conservation, that is in Terry Zoo, which mostly of you know. Um, I think things change there. When you go there, due to the COVID that was actually on, that we actually had in our country, Uganda, they still follow the SOPs. So when you reach at the zoo, they will obviously first check up everything that you have. Then the guards at the gate will surely tell you to put on your masks, wash your hands and sanitize them with the sanitizers. And then after all, you will go to the paying point where you're going to be paying all the money for the number of people that are actually you have taken for an adult you'll be paying what like ten thousand and then for the little ones like maybe two years one year you don't have to pay for them so uh when you plan on to go to the zoo expect a lot of things it is fun you would really love to come back again when you go to the eating menu there is fish we had they with uh, pizza they have literally everything and inside the zoo there is a swimming pool we all expect when you go to the zoo only to find their animals maybe you're going to 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 tour only animals but it's not the case you find their swimming pool actually you see how the uganda life conservation looks like you have to go pay that after paying there is a checkup point they have to check your bags before you actually enter into the animals and then what surprised me the most is they have rules and regulations that actually also they follow when you're trying to when you're being given a guide to make you tour around those animals they have to tell you that please do not feed the animals. If you feed the animals, you have to pay. So, planning how you know kuzu, just know that SOPs are still actually in catch. They still follow them. Don't say that kangenega sina masik. Please make sure that you move with your mask. And actually, just know that you don't have to go with any eatable. Yes, just because it was uh, my daddy's birthday, we had to go with a cake. I think that is acceptable, but you don't have to go with any eats like soda because you are expecting to buy those things inside. So there we had just entered. We're all dressed and amazingly looking lovely for the day. We had to enter. You have to request for the guide on the office there where you pay money so you have to wait for the guide you enter you also find a beach where you get time to see the waves and actually everything the marabou stars those are called in luganda kaloli and then you get a chance to see them actually these animals are really very funny those birds and actually the monkeys those monkeys you see actually when i tell you something about them those monkeys can literally steal they can open up bags and they get out everything that you actually you have gotten in your bags for as long as it they are eats and then drinks maybe like sodas and then you get also a chance to look at the nice and wonderful waves by the beach those are the maraboosters that i'm talking about Actually, I found uh, the wildlife conservation that is at uh, Entebbe Zoo to be a place where you can go with family, have fun, because there are also very many things, apart from animals that you're going to tour around, the chimpanzees, the scorpions, the cobras, the zebras, the giraffes, the ostrich, and also one amazing thing, the bird that is the crested crane the bird that actually is on the ugandan flag you'll get a chance to also have chance to look at it it was an amazing day don't forget to pack your swimsuits whether you want to go swim in the at the beach or you will want to go at the poolside
So when you go there, there are lots of things, but you have to pay for some when you enter there. Like for enjoying the, the actually the, the swimming pool, then the Swissers are there that bike ride. For you to enjoy it, you have to pay 5K for you to enjoy it. You have to pay, then you enjoy. When you go to the side of riding the donkey, you also get a chance to see me riding the donkey. You have to pay still money to enjoy. And the sum of money that you actually pay, you have to pay 5000 also to enjoy the donkey, actually, to, to enjoy it. It was really an amazing day. It was really amazing for me to go to out the wildlife conservation. So that is me on the donkey. You also get a chance to enjoy it. And if you ever think of a place to go when you feel like you want to go have fun with family, think of wildlife conservation that is in Tebe Zoo where you will have fun. You get a chance to meet lots of things and actually you will never get disappointed. We had to eat fish, we had to eat pizza, soda, and everything that actually we wanted. So it was an amazing day. It was an amazing day for us. Spending time at the zoo, looking at the birds, the marabou stars, and actually seeing a fisherman actually trying to get fish. It was really amazing. You could opt for everything but just think of the zoo to have fun to enjoy you can go with a ball you play basketball you play football anything of your choice but i got a chance to get to know everything i got a chance even to see the zakayo grave graveyard actually where they buried zakayo it was an amazing thing it was an, as an amazing day but let me leave you at that so that you also get a chance to enjoy each and everything. The monkeys, the rye, the seesaws, each and everything. Just subscribe to the channel so that you get a chance to also know about the history of Zakayo, the chimpanzee that actually died, where it was buried, and actually who is the person that actually came into the legs. That thing that you see, it's a crab. Many people eat it. But I don't think that maybe most of you actually have gotten a chance to get a chance to test it. Anyway, I would like to love you all. God bless you for me. If you have any question about the zoo, that is the Wildlife Conservation Education Center, you can actually drop down a comment below. I will be able to tell you each and everything. If you go on a working day, you will not get a chance to to around the the water maybe on the boat but if you go there on a sunday then you'll get chance to also get into the boat and then tour around you get that ride and then also another thing that i don't want to forget to tell you if you go on working days you literally have fun because there will not be more people there you get time to enjoy as a family not seeing each and everyone there but you as a family so that is it you can actually ask anything you want about the zoo so that i will literally try to give you the information i love you all god bless you for me let's have fun if you find this video constructive to you or helpful to you just subscribe to the channel drop down a comment and also give it a thumbs up i love you all god bless you ciao ciao and bye bye